been slacking off on black subjects lately. They bore me. So there's a subject just recently I touched on. You know, it's pretty interesting. I thought I put in some pretty good insight. So, I'm watching to see which videos are linked to the original video. And I did my video, and it wasn't linked to her video. And I'm thinking, you know, regardless if you dislike a person or not, there are some intangibles that you just don't do. And this young lady, she's a very smart young lady. I, I like her. I watch a few of her episodes. I am not a subscriber. I was going to be, but I'll wait. Watch a few more videos first. So, um, I'm going through her little library checking out some things. And there's one thing that surprised me because this is what made me do the original video the reply to Solo Black being a hypocrite because Solo Black's full of shit and all this Willie Pete crap now this is me fucking with you Solo Black you alright but um so I did that you know video and I tried to point out some things from my perspective I have dated a white person before I've dated a few white people I'm married to a black woman. Um, remember one time in my life, my uncle said, you keep on bringing them white girls around here, you won't be able to catch a black one. Shit like that. So let me get back on point here. Now, you are a black woman. Um, you show your picture, somewhat like the Willie Pete just shows a picture. Yeah. You make sense when you speak, you know, you have valid questions and, you know, you know, you're not just blowing wind out your ass. But you did one classless thing. You did something that was so nasty that it belittled you in my mind. Now, first of all, Soul in Black, when you listen to his voice, he sounds mixed. You see him, he's a light-skinned brother. He may be mixed. You hear it in his voice that he's had an influence other than brothers just sitting around him. He speaks in a manner where you can understand him. He ain't all ebonically deficient. He comes off like a real brother. But he comes off somewhat educated and isolated. I don't know. I don't live in this man's skin. And I ain't passing judgment on him. I'm just saying what I see. He has that in his voice. It ain't all soul. But that's life. You know? And you, because if I'm going to mention his voice, I got to mention yours too. You don't even sound like you're an American. Sounds you like you're from England. Some shit like that. Cross the sea, baby. There where the racism is different. So, I don't know. If you ask me, do you side with the English girl? Crumpets and tea and bullshit? Or the young half-breed cat that probably had it all fucked up because mom or dad may be white. I don't know. Or, you know, even Spanish or, or something. He doesn't sound like he's from the dirt part of the hood. And you don't sound like you're from the dirt part of England. The moral of the story is this. What I'm saying was so classless about what you said was you mentioned this man's wife. You know, first of all, I don't give a damn if the man was married to a purple woman, a green woman. That's his business. You don't see his wife on the fucking videos talking about she don't like your videos. Uh, or his baby mama talk about, uh, you know, you just want to fuck a white man. But, you know... Blackness is more than what the white man has ever done to black people. The white man have been done wrong too. You don't see them tripping off their captors. You don't see them oh, bitching about the people that are fucking them over. But then you got black people talking shit about black people. You got a, a black woman 
talking about this man's baby mama, his his first wife. His first wife ain't had nothing to do with YouTube. I don't know her either, but I know this. I know that's pretty fucked up. You're fucking one of the, one of the white people, and and you know, foul ass language from someone that's supposed to be proving the point. Now to say this man is a hypocrite is to say this. It's very hypocritical of you, a black man who was once married to a white woman, blah, blah, but you went off into fucking the white man. I mean, that belittled the beautiful sister. Out of most of your videos, I've really never seen that side of you. That means I didn't pay attention when I was watching your videos. That means something didn't catch me. You know, somebody once said, um, you're no sexy sci-fly because I know sexy sci-fly. Some shit like that. that. You know, I think the guy said Kennedy, though, but I'm just using sci-fly as an analogy because I hear this guy mentioning Jay Ryder in all his videos. You know, soul in black. Let Jay Ryder go. Leave that shit alone. It's just bullshit, man. If Jay Ryder wants to say some shit that you don't like, let him talk. You know, it's like, no matter what somebody can say, let them fucking talk. This chick that's beating up on soul and black, yelling at his wife, talking about his wife is this and this and that and this and that. That's foul. Because you're supposed to be a lady. Now, soul and black is going to listen to this, and he knows exactly what I'm going to say next. Sergeant Willie Pete is listening to this and he knows exactly what I'm going to say next. Fucking wise Nubian is listening to this shit and he knows what I'm going to say next. Jay Ryder, so on and so forth. You are a black woman of a higher fucking level. You're talking shit and bringing yourself down. You're bringing yourself down to ghetto status. Where in the fuck have you ever heard, ever heard of a ghetto chick from England? Teas and crumpets, baby. You have placed yourself on a pedestal and successfully talked yourself off of it. And I'm going to explain how. You dropping F-bombs like a man and shit. I'm talking about he's fucking. You sound like a jealous woman. You mad at that white woman for having a kid for him. You don't even know her. That's what you came off like a jealous black woman. And that's the whole purpose of the Sergeant Willie P. He's supposed to make black women look bad. He just gave him 50 points. And then uh, Soul and Black's supposed to be one of Willie P's boys. You didn't gave him you didn't gave him 100 points. I'm the real AIX. I'm not even in this game. But I'm telling you, you made yourself look bad. Not bad in a sense to where it's, you know, shit, I'll never watch her videos again. But bad in the sense that an image that I saw could have been was tarnished. You get it? It's like someone that, yeah, shit. I can I can tell the, the sisters and the little girls that, that watch my show to go check her out. But then you bust off cussing on somebody. Can you see my video hood report? You appear to be the black girls that run out of the shadows to yell and scream at the two Mexican, the three Mexican girls walking by. You, you came off like, so you're married to, I heard you're married to a white woman. Who gives a fuck who Soul and Black's married to? Soul and Black, wife and kids and shit, they, they, they ain't even part of YouTube. I ain't never, I don't, I've been looking at this video and I don't remember seeing his wife in the video commenting on any of your shit. They even mentioning you. I ain't seeing his kids and nobody mention you <laughs> in no video. But you gonna come on and say, fucking a white woman, fucking the white man's daughter. And come on. You 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 had me at so I heard you were married to a white woman. Then you changed the subject. You put a, a brick there, and then he would have came out and explained to you just like he did. I'm sorry for wasting your time, but uh, you've been tubed.